A very good afternoon, Dutch bike blogger. Thank you for riding with me. Unfortunately, a little bit of drizzle today. On my way from my home here in the Korrewegwijk to Mooiland. This is my brother. It's not super warm, it's actually not super cold either. Not wearing a jacket, no gloves. I'm sorry, I'm wearing a jacket. No hat, no gloves. And someone is faster than I am. On a partially disintegrating bike. Well, good for him, good for everybody. Well, last time I went out and about was last Friday, now a Sunday afternoon. Children. Taking maximum advantage of the available road space. Well. Uphill bridge. Still a little drizzle. Lucky enough, not that much. But weather forecast told me I'm actually going to get rain. Very curious. Hope this doesn't doesn't come. But it remains drizzly. But I can tell you when I. Would not have gone out, or had to gone out, have to gone out. I would not have to have have done it. Gee, what an incredible, stupid sentence. Basically, when I didn't have to, and wouldn't go outside. I didn't have to. Well, you get the deal. Well, same old, same old. Were 
lift feet, otherwise wet socks. Well, same old road, Tadiga Plus. In the summertime, it's quite busy here. People are laying about on the grass, on their towels, getting some sunshine, bathing. And it's a lot, lot busier than it's now. fiddling with an umbrella she just could see Just informing people because it would not be here the first time that people move from the right to the left when I come around there, around here. Mind you, facing traffic is the best option. So the woman with the dog, there was a dog to the side, not on a leash by the way, could have better walked on this side. like so and she would have seen traffic and when you drive on this side like I'm doing now with your back to traffic you're gonna not going to see anything at all which means no traffic no nothing and now this is a bike lane but also scooters are allowed here but the same people I'm talking about and you know who you are We'll do the same thing on a road where cars drive and a poorly lit road in the evening in darkness walking your dog with your back to traffic and it would not be the first time that someone got hurt or killed this is the correct way also, this is the correct way. Like I said, it wouldn't be the first time that people get themselves hurt or killed. And then the car driver never, never saw you. Also, it's advisable when you go by dark road get some light on your body or dark clothing with reflection or lighter clothing but something that makes you visible visible to the rest of the world So when you're on bike, on foot or drive a car, have a look at it how many people face or don't face traffic but walk with their back to traffic hoping that another one who's there cares and takes you in account and sees you and does not run you over then more than you think.
Well, it was a quick ride. It's not a bad thing to do it like this. Because like I said, it's drizzling. Not the funnest time to drive a bike. Well, thank you very much for watching. Please like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're not a subscriber yet. Check out the description box. I will see you next time. Have a very nice day. And like always, be safe out there. And please, please take my advice about walking on roads facing traffic and not with your back to traffic, please. <laughs>